Hello everyone, today's video for biochemistry in just 3 minutes is galactosemia. So first definition of galactosemia. So galactosemia is inborn error of galactose metabolism associated with deficiency of enzyme galactose 1-phosphate uridyl transferase enzyme. Now as this enzyme is deficient, so there will be accumulation of galactose 1-phosphate in the blood. Now what are the characteristic features of galactosemia? So, child suffering from galactosemia will be having vomiting, lethargy, failure to thrive, feeding difficulties. As there is an increased level of galactose in the blood, so it will cause galactosemia and this galactose will start appearing in the urine. So, it will result in a galactosuria and it will give Benedict test positive. Now, as there is accumulation of galactose 1-phosphate, so this galactose 1-phosphate will inhibit glycogen phosphorylase enzyme. So there will be decreased hepatic glycogenolysis and ultimately it will result in a hypoglycemia. And this glycogen 1-phosphate along with glycogen will start getting deposited in the liver which will result in a hepatomegaly, cirrhosis and hepatic failure. The sum amount of galactose will be reduced to galactitol and this galactitol will start getting deposited in the lens of eye which will result in a congenital cataract. And this is one of the characteristic feature of galactosemia. Some amount of galactose 1-phosphate will also start getting deposited in the brain and it will result in a mental retardation. So these are the characteristic feature of galactosemia. Now diagnosis. So diagnosis can be done with the help of Benedict test as there is a excretion of, galact excretion of galactose in the urine. So Benedict test will be positive along with mucic acid test will also be positive and as there is a hypoglycemia so glucose oxidase test will be negative. Early diagnosis can be done with the help of MU sentences. Then you can also do the chromatography test. So this is about the diagnosis. Now what are the treatment options? So child has to give lactose free diet till 4 to 5 years of age because after 4 to 5 years of age Another enzyme that is galactose 1-phosphate pyrophosphorylase become active which will help in a metabolism of galactose 1-phosphate. So lactose free diet is compulsory till 4 to 5 years of age and early diagnosis is important because once mental retardation occurs you can't reverse it. So that is all about galactosemia one of the important topic for the NEET PG as well as first MBBS exam it can be asked as a case study. Thank you.